Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to learn about the find command in Linux. The find command is used to search and locate the list of files and directories based on conditions you specify. It can be used in a variety of conditions like you can find files by permissions, users, groups, file types, etc. Now let us look at its syntax. So we have the find word followed by where to start searching from, followed by the options and lastly what to find. As you can see in the first example, we find a file called testfile.txt in the current and subdirectories. In the next example, we are finding all the files with .jpg extension in the home and its subdirectories. Now, let us look at some of the options available with the find command. Find space minus name followed by the file name searches for the given specified file name. Minus I name followed by the file name searches for the file name irrespective of the upper and lower case. Minus newer space file name searches for all files that were modified or created after the specified file name. Minus user space username searches for files owned by the specified username. Minus perm followed by permissions searches for the file with desired file permissions. Now, let us look at these examples on a system. So, to demonstrate how we are going to use the find command, I am just going to take a moment here and create a bunch of files using the touch command. So I have created four files, one with a txt extension, one with a php extension and two with a jpg extension. Now let us try finding the file one.txt. So I'll type find space the current directory followed by minus name and followed by the file name. As you can see it has returned the file path which means that the file exists. If we type find space directory space minus name space file 10 dot txt it will not return anything as this file doesn't exist in a directory. Next if we search find space dot space minus name space img2.jpg it will not return anything. However, if we search this with a minus i name it will return us the file. As minus i name option searches irrespective of upper and lower case. Now let me create another file new.txt. Let's suppose that we need to find the file which was created by our previously created files. So we can use find space dot space minus newer followed by one of the file name which we previously created. So as you can see we got the newly created file. If you want to find all the empty files we can type find space dot space minus empty. So all these files that we created are empty. Now let's suppose that you need to find all the files with a given specified username. So we can type find space minus user followed by the username which in my case is user. As you can see these are all the files owned by 
the specified username. That's all for the find command. For any doubts or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.